In this video, I will be sharing some homemaker tips on make-ahead foods. We'll be spending time in the garden, and I'll show you how we make our family favorite pizza dough. If you've been following me for a while, you know that I love the grocery delivery services versus going into stores. I feel like it helps so much with the budget and keeping with the grocery list that you make ahead of time. bean and cheese burritos and we usually buy them from the store you know the frozen section they have a bag of them but you know it's easy to actually make those at home it's literally the tortilla refried beans and the cheeses of your choice and you wrap them in plastic wrap and that can go straight into the freezer for a good week i make about 24 of these to freeze so that we can eat them throughout the week just for snacks or just grab go meals and it has been a lifesaver for the kids when they go off to play at the playground or whenever we have our kids friends over they can just grab some and eat while they hang out you never told to no one else family goes to Starbucks we always grab those refrigerated wraps and I thought you know what I can make these at home too so tortilla again with a little bit of meat lettuce cheese and mayo will work great and you can add or take away anything from this wrap and it, it refrigerates very well for the whole entire week sister has been encouraging me to create theme based meals every single day to help with food preparation and you know what it's been working very well so for instance our family is doing Sunday crock pot or casserole meals Mondays will be rice with the main dish Tuesdays are tacos Wednesdays are sandwiches Thursdays are pasta night Fridays are pizza night and Saturdays will be our takeout night. And it's been so helpful prepping weekly meals this way because at the end of the day, I don't have to reinvent the wheel anymore and 
It's been such a blessing. two free planter boxes out in my neighborhood and I thought this would be a great idea to hang on our brick walls in our back garden. So sturdy and it's really helping us bring more color into our garden this year. I recently made pickled onions and they are the best thing I have ever made that is super easy and with minimal ingredients. I got this recipe from um, one of my favorite YouTubers. Her name is Sarah Therese and it is such a simple yet flavorful recipe. I'll make sure to link her video that shows you how to make it below. Won't you please help me do what you're bidding? I need the courage, I know you can help me. Am I ready? I don't know. Am I ready? You seem to think so. So let's go. Something else that has been on rotation in my home since the summer has began is lemonade and sweet tea. The distractions get me from hearing Why you whisper in your call Telling me you were the one I was needing Always forgiving me when I was weak Silently guiding through valleys and peaks All the while shining I have finally perfected our family pizza dough recipe and I found that the secret ingredient to making a really good pizza dough is flavoring the pizza dough. So I do just a basic pizza dough recipe and then add onion powder and garlic powder to it and it elevates it just enough so that you can taste all the flavors.
since we always do pizza night on Friday night, our family has been opening our doors up to our friends to come together while we all make pizza. And it's been such a great ministry for us. Yes. Hope you enjoyed today's video if you like this content please subscribe like and share and i'll see you in the next video bye